Hi, I'm Dr. Kurt Wooler. You know, there's a lot of strange things that sometimes pop up in practice that you see with different types of patients. And one of the things that I've seen, you know, from time to time with kids on the autism spectrum is that some kids will have a vocal, or what appears to be a vocal type of stem, where they make the sound E or some other type of high pitched sound over and over and over continuously. Um, and admittingly, it tends to drive people nuts, um, you know, as a parent or as a caregiver, whatever it may be, okay? So, you know, a lot of kids just can't control it. So we understand that, but we sometimes find it hard, well, what's causing it? What, what may be a reason that that's happening? Well, I've, I've seen some kids who did this type of behavior that when they started taking more customized amino acids and replacing various deficient amino acids, that behavior disappeared. So it kind of led me to feel that maybe this is something is more common, um, a way to approach this particular type of problem with kids on the spectrum. So if your child actually is making those high tip vocal, high, uh, um, you know, high pitched vocal noises, is doing E or something similar, okay, then in my experience it'd be worthwhile to have your doctor run an amino acid profile. You can either do a urine amino acid profile, I, I generally like to run plasma amino acid profiles fasting and see where the deficiencies are. And if there are deficiencies, you can actually have a customized amino acid product produced from a compounding pharmacy, have your child take it, in many cases you'll see that symptom disappear. I've seen in my practice, so it leads me to believe it certainly can happen with other kids uh, and other doctor's offices as well. Okay, thanks.